Hi, this is Jill Duffy for PCMag.com and this is Get Organized. In this video, we'll be looking at cleaning up iTunes. The first thing we need to do is fill in missing information. See here how I have some unnamed tracks? There's also no artist listed and the album name is wrong. So here's the quickest way to fix it. We're going to use a tool in the advanced setting called Get Track Names. This tool will connect to an online database of music information where it will retrieve the missing pieces so iTunes can fill them in automatically. The second thing we can do is fill in the missing album artwork, but you can't do that unless you have correct metadata first. So let's quickly grab that metadata again and make iTunes do the heavy work for us. So here we are getting track names, and there it's updated. Now we can go into the advanced menu or just hold control while clicking and select get album artwork. The third and final thing we're going to do here is delete duplicate tracks. Go to file, display duplicates, and iTunes will show you any tracks that it thinks are duplicates. Now you have to be careful here. If you have incorrect metadata, like song title or artist, you could inadvertently delete a song that wasn't actually a duplicate. I've left a few bad files in here so you could see what I mean. So just make sure before you do this step that all of your metadata is up to date. If it is, there are any number of ways you can go about deleting the duplicates, but I like to sort by name or title so that I can kind of spot check as I go along to make sure that what I'm deleting is actually a duplicate. For PCMag.com, I'm Jill Duffy, helping you stay organized. Feel free to email me your questions at jill underscore duffy at pcmag.com.